Hello my beautiful Tauruses. Welcome to a new reading for my channel. It's called The Next Six Months. What we're going to look at is you, uh, singles, couples, or anyone in between, or anyone who needs love messages, okay? And we're going to look at what's going on for the next six months. The time period is going to be August 2021 to February 2022. It's gonna be a 15 card spread, okay? I'm going to look at different aspects via romantic love life and career and finance. So if you guys like my channel, hit that like button and stick with me till the end. And thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. And thank you to my members for all of your support. I'm not doing personal readings at this time. They're closed at this time. So I'll go, I will update you guys when they're open again. However, I do have a free reading contest going on. So stick with me to the end and I'll share all the details. Yes. So let's jump right in here. I don't want to take up too much time. Tauruses, romantic, love life. Tauruses, career and finance. For the time period of August 2021 to February 2022. Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Now I will be using the Lenormand to clarify career and finance. I will be using the Aizen to clarify the uh, romance. Okay, so let's throw down these cards and please guys remember that these are general messages. So you can check your moon, your rising and your sun sign for more information. Your sun sign represents your soul, your moon sign represents your emotions, and your rising sign represents your physical you. All three of these make up who you are, so feel free to cross watch for more information. Okay, so this is gonna represent two months here. Oh my goodness, you guys got the tower card for the next two months. But it's actually a very happy situation, so that's good. Okay. And then this is the next two months. Okay, all right, so two, four, six. Okay, so we're going from August till February. All right, so let's talk about first for the next first two months, okay, for your romantic love life. Well, you guys, there's a defensive energy. I don't want to get hurt. Somebody definitely has their wall up here, okay? However, this new opportunity of passion comes in for you guys, okay? And this person uh, has a sense of heartache, or for some of you, there may be another person involved, okay? Because we see the Three of Swords energy and we see the Two of Wands energy, if I mirror that, because the central theme is saying, okay, there's heartache here. And there's defensive energy about getting hurt because of heartache, because of a choice that needs to be made for some of you. So there may be another person involved. You may have more than one choice or option because the three of swords energy is coming up. And then we see that this opportunity of passion is very hopeful here with star card energy, okay? If we look at the numbers of this, the numbers of this is telling me desires are being fulfilled because there's an opportunity of passion. There's a sense of heartache or you have more than one choice or option. There's something very hopeful and you're going to have to go down this road and make a choice here. So a passionate choice with the two of wands energy. Let's go further on this. And now I'm going to clarify with the romance cards and then we're going to look at your career and finance and then we'll move on to the next two months and then the next two months. Okay. So I'm going to cover love for the first two months all the way through. All right. So I don't want to confuse you guys. All right. So Taurus's romantic love life. For August 2021 to February 2022. Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. So let's clarify for romance still. We're still in romance. This, this situation is very obsessive, okay? There is a lot of strong desires, a lot of strong attachments here. There seems to be delays around your romantic love life or some challenges around it when it comes to this opportunity of passion. You are very happy about this connection. There is a happiness about this connection. It looks like you're going to have to take control of this and assert yourself here to fulfill your desires. And the book card is saying that you're gonna to have to gain knowledge or there's something secret about this when it comes to these obsessions, these strong desires. The challenge is taking control and asserting yourself to what you want here with your happiness, okay? Now, let's take a look at career and finance for the next two months, okay? All right, let me move this out of the way. So 
we see that you guys are defensive. You have a new opportunity coming in. Um, I do have a sense that yes, it's like kind of a bit of a, 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 an issue for you. But you're wanting to fulfill your desires and now you're gonna have to make some choices here. Going further on this, Taurus's career and finance for the next six months, August to February 2022. Show my cards I need to see. Okay, I just wanna show me the cards I need to see. All right, so what's this defensive energy about? You're stressing here. There's some stress happening here with this mice card energy. And it looks like this opportunity is coming in because of a person. And this heartache has to do with uh, revealing some things about the situation or you are focused on what makes you happy here. So stress when it comes to this person, when it comes to your happiness here, that's the defensive energy here. We see that you're going to end the situation here with the coffin card. You're going to take a break here because you want to fulfill your desires and when it comes to your career and finance. And you're going to make a choice based on money and finance here with the fish card energy. Or for some of you, you're going to make the, the choice based on emotions there with the fish card energy. But I feel like because of the fact that the sun card can represent material happiness, I feel like you're stressing and you want to focus on your material happiness. So you're going to make the choice based on money here. And you're going to end this situation with this person. End, stop, complete. Okay, so let's now look at the next two months here. We're back to romantic love life again, okay? So, Taurus, it looks like for romantic love life for the, the next two months after that, okay, so we, we did August and September, so now we're looking at November and December. So November and December. So really some shocking, surprising things are gonna happen to you, which is really gonna make you happy here. The Three of Pentacles tells me that, yes, there's going to be a want to build a foundation with you with that Three of Pentacles energy. And also I hear a car in the background. You always listen to whatever happens during the reading because there's an omen. It's gonna happen fast because that car was like really ramming it. They were going for it. And it looks like it's gonna give you a victory here. And it looks like there is going to be a sense of, oh, I hope I don't regret this. Five of Cups energy. So the shocking surprise is like, okay, am I gonna regret this? Look, look at the numbers of this. It's saying, okay, there's something really shocking happening here, okay? That makes you happy. Three is like, I'm looking at my choices and options as a creative solution. Six is saying you're uh, having a victory here. There's a healing and recovery and love and there's some big cha things changing here. Big things changing, you can see that. So now let's take a look at the romantic love life. The shocking surprise is to do with the next partner. Resolving something to do with the past. And they have regrets here. This makes you happy finding out about these regrets. You're going to have to make a wise choice and a wise decision. Obviously they want your attention and they're trying to be patient because they feel like you're worth putting the time in here with the patient card energy. And the regrets are coming out because, wow, they do have romantic feelings for you. And it has to do with an ex-partner here and regrets. And you're like, all right, I need to make a wise choice and a wise decision. You know what, let's see how this plays out here with the Seven of Pentacles kind of energy. So now let's take a look at your career and finance here. Okay, let's move this out of the way now. What's the tower card about for your career in finance? There's burdens and responsibilities with the cross card energy. You're getting some good news here, which make you happy. There's something to do with a corporate environment or structure here. If you get a surprise, you get recognition because that's the bouquet card energy. So you guys are gonna get recognized, you're gonna get a bonus for some of you. And it looks like there seems to be this sense of change or regrets after a long time. So you're regretting some things or you're trying to be wise in your decision making because you don't want to be regretful. Okay, so let's keep going here. Now we're going to move to the last two months. So January, February. Okay, so it looks like with the Four of Cups energy, you guys, when it comes to romance, because we're back to romance again now for the last two months, it looks like someone has a sense that they're missing an opportunity with you with the Four of Cups energy. They've been looking at things very deeply and they do want to connect with you. Uh, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo energy. They want to take care of you. They want to be very nurturing and supportive here. And this person looks like they're getting serious with the Four of Wands energy. There is a sense of stability and stableness. Our marriage and long-term commitment here with the Four of Wands energy. So clarifying this. This missed opportunity is because of uh, cutting away unhealthy things from the past or an abrupt decision that's being made. 
the deep heavy soul searching is because all right something needs to be brought into balance here there's a hopeful energy because there is chemistry and passion and then we see the reconciliation card it's a very healing energy and we see you guys have an opportunity for a long-term commitment or marriage here what oh my god Taurus <laughs> okay let's now take a look at um let's take a look at your career and finance to finish this out here okay so remember this is going to be the last two months okay so there's a conversation about some opportunities and it's it's a stable situation that you're gonna have to think about there's a friend that helps you out with this situation or something to do with someone who uh, is being friendly or a friend to you and you're going to have to make a decision about something to do with abundance here and it is a stable situation for some of you possibly making a decision or a conversation about real estate or a stable situation or there's an abrupt, decisi abrupt decision being made about love, something that you love and something that's abundant when it comes to house or long term or real estate. But there is a stable situation coming in for you guys. Wow, a stable situation. Four wands is stability and stableness. Going further on these numbers here. Stability and stableness, internal thinking about this, really looking at this, and you know, you're very passionate about this, and there is abundance here for you guys and a stable situation. Four wands energy. Wow, what a, you guys have a great reading ending out there. Okay. All right, my beautiful Tauruses, if you guys like this way, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. Yes, it, critique this reading and let me know what you liked about it, what you didn't like about it. Let me know in the comments below. For the free reading contest, uh, all you do is put love in the comments below. I'm gonna be picking two people at the end of August for a free personal reading. Uh, if you don't see your comment right away, don't get worried. It's just because um, I have a filter right on right now with the um, first spam. I'm trying to protect you guys from spam. All right, so I love you guys so much. The next reading that's coming out, because remember I did a survey on my community tab, and you guys can check that out. The next reading is X Return. So stay tuned for that in another day or two. I love you guys so much. Have a great rest of your next couple of months, and I will see you soon.